On November 1, 2023, Iorio provided a detailed look at the ASCOD-2 Sabra command vehicle included in a recent delivery by Elbit Systems to the Philippine Army. This particular version, spotted in Manila, is equipped with a Utah 30 unmanned turret also manufactured by Elbit Systems. The Utah 30 unmanned turret is a widely used weapon system employed by various armed forces worldwide offering a range of armament options, including cannons, 25 or 30 mm, coaxial machine guns, 7.62 mm, and anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs. It also features optional protection systems like ballistic armor protection, smoke grenade launchers, laser warning systems, and countermeasures. The advanced fire control system includes automatic target tracking, dual-axis stabilized sights, a ballistic computer, thermal sensors, and displays. The unmanned turret design minimizes deck penetration, ensuring protection for ammunition and electro-optics while preserving the internal space. It is known for delivering high accuracy in the first round and burst fire, making it effective against moving targets. Additionally, it offers the capability for independent gunner and commander sites, air burst munition, ABM, capability, and integration with battle management systems for network-centric warfare. As reported by Army Recognition on October 27, 2023, a new batch of ASCOD-2 armored vehicles arrived in Subic, a coastal municipality in the Philippines, located northwest of the capital city, Manila. According to information available at the time, this delivery consisted of eight ASCOD-2 Sabra light tanks and one ASCOD-2, which could be either an ARV or a command variant. However, as reported by Pitt's Defense Analysis on October 28, 2023, this batch included a total of 20 ASCODII Sabra, including 18 light tanks, one command vehicle, and one recovery unit. These vehicles are designated for use by the Philippine Army's Armor, Hombado, Division and are part of the Philippine Army's Light Tank Acquisition Project, which was awarded to Elbit Systems, an Israeli defense company. In January 2021, Elbit Systems secured a three-year contract valued at $172 million to supply Sabra light tanks to the Philippine Army. The delivery of these tanks is expected to be completed by 2023, with the intention of assigning them to the Philippine Army's sole armored division. The Sabra light tank is designed by Elbit Systems based on the ASCOD and Pander 2 platforms. It is a tracked or wheeled light tank manufactured by Elbit Systems, an Israeli defense manufacturing company. Its purpose is to complement the existing fleet of armored fighting vehicles, AFVs, used by armed forces worldwide. The tracked light tank configuration is based on the tracked ASCOD AFV platform, which is manufactured by General Dynamics European Land Systems, Santa Barbara Sistemis, GDEEL SSBS, a part of the American Aerospace and Defense Company General Dynamics. The Sabra light tank series, weighing 30 tons, features a modular design. It is equipped with a common 105mm manned turret suitable for both tracked and wheeled configurations. The vehicle's fully electric turret drive offers stabilization in both elevation and traverse. The dual-axis high-performance turret provides enhanced capabilities. The tank is designed to offer a balance between firepower and maneuverability, with the potential for enhanced lethality. 
The Sabra includes armor protection systems that provide ballistic protection up to NATO Stanag 4569 Level 4. The vehicle can be integrated with active protection systems and incorporates Elbit Systems Torch X Battle Management System. It also features electro-optical EO sights, fire control systems, and life support systems. The Philippine Army categorizes this version as a tracked light tank. The base platform is the ASCOD-2, which features a seven-wheel station chassis and NATO Stanag 4569 Level 4 ballistic protection. The vehicle provides advanced mobility and mine protection capabilities due to ongoing technology upgrades made possible by the platform's open system architecture. The vehicle is powered by an 8-cylinder diesel engine coupled to a hydromechanical transmission system. As part of the contract, Elbit Systems will supply various vehicle configurations, including 18 tracked light tanks based on the ASCOD2 platform. 10-wheeled light tanks based on the Pander 2 platform, as well as one command vehicle and one recovery vehicle based on the ASCOD2 platform. The initial requirement set by the Philippine Army called for a fleet of 144 light tanks and tank destroyers, underscoring the scale of this defense project.